Hello student, I am Ashish Chawla and today we start the new topic that is playing with numbers. Uh, before starting this chapter, first of all we know that uh, the different types of numbers. Uh, first we talk about the natural numbers. Uh, the numbers that we are used for counting are known as natural numbers and the set of natural numbers are represented by capital letter N. So all the counting numbers are known as natural numbers. Example 1, 2, 3 and so on. The set of all these counting numbers form a natural number. After that natural numbers we have whole numbers. If we include 0 in the set of natural numbers then it becomes a whole number and the set of whole numbers is represented by capital letter W. So natural numbers that is 1, 2, 3 along with 0. So 0, 1, 2, 3 it will form a set of whole numbers. And what are integers? Integers are denoted by i or z letter z so the integers is the whole numbers that is 0 1 2 3 and so on and the negative of the natural numbers that is minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 and so on so on the right hand side of 0 they are the positive integers denoted by i plus and on the left hand side of the 0 there are the negative integers denoted by i minus and it should be noted that the zero having no sign zero have no sign it is neither positive nor negative so these are the basic numbers now uh, we see uh, how we can write a given number in general form number in general form Let's say uh, if I have a two digit number, let's say 73. So if I write in general form, uh, so in 73, 3 is the unit place, so unit digit, because it is written at the unit place, and 7 is the tens digit because it is written at the tens place. And if I write in general form, so I write tens digit that is 7 into 10 plus unit digit that is 3 into 1 so this is the number in general form 73 is can be written as 7 that is tens digit into 10 plus unit digit into 1 so if I have a 3 digit number let's see let's say 256 so 6 is the unit digit 5 is the tens digit and 2 is the hundredth and if I want to write in the general form, I write as 100 digit multiplied by 100, tens digit multiplied by 10, and the unit digit multiplied by 1. So in this way, we can write. So in general, if AB is a two digit number, then it can be written as A is the tens digit, so it should be multiplied with 10 and b is the unit digit so it should be multiplied by 1 so the two digit number ab can be written as a into 10 plus b into 1 now when the digits are reversed so this is your number now when the digits are reversed when the digits are reversed that is the tens digit becomes unit digit and the unit digits become 10 digits if the number is ab if the digits are reversed then it becomes ba so we write the reverse number in general form as b uh, now b is the tens digit so b should be multiplied with 10 and the a is now unit digit so it should be multiplied by 1 so this is your reverse number or the numbers which is obtained by interchanging the digits now if in the question it is given that the sum of the digit so as the digits are a and b so its sum is a plus b now if question is given that the product of digit we write a into b because a and b are the digits. So the question in asks that the number, find the number, the number should be a into 10 plus b into 1. So 
let's do problem based on this a number of two digit a number of two digit has a number of two digit has three for its unit digits has three for its unit digit three for its unit digit and the sum of digits and sum of digits is 1 by 7 of the number itself of the number itself then what is the number what is the let's see how we can solve it uh, it is given that the a number has a two digit has three for its unit digit unit digit is given to us unit digit is 3 let's assume that the tens digit is so how we can form the number so number is tens digit into 10 plus unit digit so the number is 10a plus 3 so what should be the sum of the digits sum of digit unit digit is 3 and the tens digit is a so the digit sum is a plus 3 so in the question it is given that the sum of the digit is 1 by 7 of the number that is sum of digit is equals to 1 seventh of the number now putting the values sum of digit is a plus 3 1 by 7 of the number number is 10a plus 3 cross multiply 7 is multiplied with this 7 a plus 3 is equals to 10a plus 3 7 into a 7a 7 into 3 21 is equals to 10a plus 3. Now, after rearranging, 7a minus 10a minus 3a equals to minus 18. So, a equals to 6. So, the value of a is 6. So, our number is 10 into a plus 3. So, 10 into 6 plus 3 that is 63. So, this is your number. Next question. If the number obtained by interchanging the digits of a two digit number is eighteen more than the original number, more than the original number and the sum of the digits and the sum of the digits is 8 and the sum of the digit is 8 then what is the original number then what is the original now let's see the solution how we can do it uh, as it is given in the question that the digit sum is 8 let I assume that the unit digit is is a so the tens digit becomes 8 minus a because the sum of the digit is 8 so if I assume that the unit is a then the tens digit is 8 minus a and what should be the number the number is 10 multiplied by the tens digit plus unit digit and what should be the reverse number that is number obtained by the interchanging the digits simply interchange the digit so 8 minus a replaced by a and a replaced by 8 minus a so this is your reverse number now according to the question if the digits are interchange the digits are interchange then the number obtained is 18 more than the original number it means the reverse number is 18 more than the original number so 10a plus 8 minus a is equals to 10 times 8 minus a plus a plus 18 so now solve it uh, 10a minus a that is 9a plus 8 is equals to 10 into 8 80 minus 10a plus a plus 18 so 9a plus 8 is equals to 80 80 plus 18 that is 98 minus 10a plus a that is minus 9a. Now after rearranging, so 9a plus 9a is equals to 98 minus 8. So 18a is equals to 90. So a is equals to 90 divided by 18. That is, so the value of a is 5. So the unit digit, so what is our number? The number is, 
so 10 into 3 plus 5 so the number is 30 plus 5 that is 35 so the our number is 35 this is for today thank you